probably. Well, not probably, obviously, we're gonna go there. But... So we are here at the ground floor now, picking our favorite place. On the way home from college today, I bought some hair dye. You know, the hair dye, it actually costs quite a lot here in Australia. And it's also expensive back in UK, but I found one Chinese shop <laughs> where they're selling the brand hair dye. This one's Schwarzkopf. I've never tried these ones, but this is dark red brown. The girl's been asking what color and what brand um, hair dye I'm using so it always varies but most of the time I'm using either dark cherry or deep red colors so this one is one of them dark red brown so um, oh yeah I've also got this thingy which will lift your roots root lifting lotion it was just 250 from the same Chinese shop at the Bondi Junction oh look acrobat <laughs> I popped into Sababa the restaurant that I've been the other day, well, the other week, and and I met Monica, and we had a lovely chat. Then I made my way to the coals, bought some groceries, some veggies, some fruits. Nothing really, nothing really exciting to show you guys. And uh, now I'm getting ready. Well, in two hours I'm leaving, I'm going to the baseball game. I've never been to a baseball match because in Lithuania it's not really popular, nor it's popular in the UK. Right, so I got dressed and I'm good to go. Look what I did to my hair. Nice little braid. So this is my outfit. Oh my god, I need to open the curtains to show you how I look. So basically white jeans, this top that says vitamin on it, my protein with a mesh with the transparent shoulders. This is the bomber jacket, I love it so much. So the bus has arrived and we're just waiting for the rest of the people and then we're gonna be heading to the stadium. the stadium Gavin is playing for blue socks team just like the sports <laughs> No 
vegan meals. So what I did in advance, I had some rice cakes with peanut butter just on the go because I was rushing and I had some banana. So I feel right now, but I know that in a couple of hours I'm not going to feel hungry, but by the time I'm probably going to be at home. now picking our favorite players so we're close to the blue Sox team checking up on them all right all right look <laughs> white trousers right white pants not a bad shot of blue juice maximus isn't it jewel she is amazing gavin's wife we've got a vegan option some strawberries and what's that watermelon after taking some photos yeah that was a really cool match let's just wait for Gavin and another team members here's Cal Cal who signed on your team <laughs> getting a chance to take a picture, to take an autograph with the players and everything and yeah that was such a fun, such a cool night. Hey guys, so Annie, my new friend and I are here at the park at the Double Bay having some food. I've got sushi with avocado. My one is obviously vegan. And Annie's got one with salmon. Here it That's is. Lovely. Should be so delicious. And we've got some crackers with the dips and some snacks. So that's what we're having. It's not that late. It's like seven ish. And once we're going to have some snacks, we're going to go out to a couple of cocktail bars, probably. Well, not probably, obviously, we're going to go there, but then we're going to see where, if we're going to try to explore the Double Bay a little bit more because we don't often go out and Annie only came here like a month ago as well? Yeah, three weeks. Three weeks ago, yeah, and I'm here nearly four months, or is it four months already? Anyhow, yeah, so we're just going to enjoy our evening and you're going to probably see, see some short clips from it. Bye! Bye!
beach today to get some tan in but Laura texted me saying that she is making her way there now so I'm waiting for the bus to take me to the Edgecliff station that I'm gonna get to the I'm gonna go to the vegan market the Sun is amazing it's so nice I've got my suntan sun cream obviously for the face and for the whole body I wanted to get some suntan but I'm I'm pretty sure that I was still gonna get some once I'm gonna be at the market the weather is awesome because it was saying it's gonna be rainy and stormy this weekend but it's opposite and I love it now and I saw so many people around like bringing the bags of goodies and on the bags of paper bags it says cruelty free so I wasn't sure where I'm going but I was just following the flow following the bunch of people Unlike in the Newtown festival here, like I can eat anything, <laughs> anything and everything knowing that it's going to be 100% vegan. I forgot to take some cash with me, so now I have to queue up for the ATM to get some cash out. vegan foods, vegan everything. <laughs> Looks so good. The nail varnish, the makeup. Look, how cool is that? And obviously guys, of course, like always, try before you buy. I bought vegan mayonnaise, veganese, I think this is how they call it, and now we are queuing up for the soul burgers. Even though it has a piglet on its logo, it's absolutely cruelty free, it's all vegan. For a proper vegan cheese because the ones I've tried, they were never as good, but here it's called sprout and kernel. The gangster crew. <laughs> Again, it was so delicious and now I'm just waiting for a dessert. These are raw desserts, I think. It's either a cheesecake, but I'm panting for a salted caramel one. On the way home from the foods market, I nearly fell asleep on the bus. So I've decided that I have to go to the beach. I was thinking whether should I stay at home and have a nap or should I go on the beach and have a nap there and also catch the sun at the same time. So as you can see the decision, I'm at the beach and I just I had a swim and now just chilling. Oh, the clouds are coming. So am I gonna stay for another half an hour and then I'll make my way home. And anyhow guys, this is my weekend. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed this video because I enjoy the weekend. And you can follow me on Facebook and on Instagram at missvidat.lt and I will see you in the next clip. Bye.